morning. So we're setting off for another trip. We're going to Blackpool Illuminations. Um, so I packed up for two days, you can see. Just basically put my bag on the seat so that Molly can't try and escape from her seat. Um, and then move these mats further up, just in case she uh, <coughs> um, has a, you know, sickness. Um, but we're ready. Princess is in the back of the van, so um, we're all ready. Well, you ready to see the illuminations? Hey, eh? we're going to be staying in Preston, which is about a twenty-minute drive from uh, the illuminations. So um, it's got a good rating. So we'll see. Okay, Mo, say goodbye. Mo. Just arrived at uh, Donkey Farm Park and uh, Molly just got out of her car seat, a toilet, and she's ready just to chill out for a little bit. And we're just going to stay here for two nights. We're going to go to the Illuminations tonight. Uh, I haven't been for such a long time, and it's come here quite a lot with my granddad to Blackpool. Um, so, just a bit of reminiscing old times. Um, this is obviously very quiet because it's a, it's a Monday here. You can see here the block. Reception's on the left. Toilets are right in front. Code to get into the toilets. And barrier. And. Yeah, so again it's raining, as usual, and that's in a bit. Yeah, I can confirm, toilets are good, showers are good, this will do nicely. Oh, we're having breakfast, hey? Molly doesn't get to have a breakfast until we get to the destination demo. Interesting, but you know, he's in the sink. And uh, see, so we just parked up because we're going to go out in two, three hours' time when it gets dark. We're not bothered to change the driver's seat, just the passenger seat. Uh, not going to bother hooking up and I'll put the roof up until later or tomorrow. It's going to rain later tonight. Well, we're going to go see Black Illuminations now. It said it wasn't going to rain today. No, it's just rained, so we're hoping that is the end of it. Um, <clears throat> still done nothing. That is exactly the same as when we arrived. Um, and we're going to go straight now, Mel, are we?
probably figure out that this might uh, be somebody's dinner time. You get this look, and then the look at the food, then the look back at you, and then look at food, and then you have to give in. Okay, Malt, you want your dinner? Your dinner? Okay, let's get your dinner. So if you've watched our other videos, you've probably seen uh, what we normally eat on our first night. Um, so pre-made chilli at home, some rice, and um, easily prepared when we get here on arrival, so it's nice and quick, and done in a few minutes, and then lovely. It's our regular. We like it, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> and then all, yeah, all that's left is uh, the washing up, which is just waiting here. Mo, what have you just detected? What have you just detected? You smell cake. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Chocolate You smell the cake mm. from the Christmas market. What is it? Chocolate strawberry. Yeah, a bit that. So we decided we're going to put the top up. Um, and I just want to show you quickly how easy it is on this ocean. Um, first thing you got to do is make sure you've got your key in ignition. I've slid the cover back so you can see that now. So that's that bit done. Uh, pop top, open. Push the button. Yep, everything's fine. Telling me to stop. So that is it. Roofs up. Got a nice little cover here. You can see this? A bit of netting. Just keep your valuables in if you want. Um, I'll just go to now the lights. Oops, it's the leveler. Um, the lights and living area. And you can see here, got the top two lights up here. I'll turn them up. And then, that's it, roof's up, lights are on, um, you can switch them off down there. And then, uh, we're obviously not going to sleep up here tonight because it's a little bit chilly. So just push up the bed, nice and easy, up she goes, and that's it. Because you can instantly feel the draft, obviously, because we're in uh, December, but... Um, the heat is going to get a bit more work, but amazing how much more. Ouch. How much space you've got. Cool. Um, must remember to take the key out as well, now that I've done that. Yeah, this is nice now to, this is the first time we've had the uh, top up because it's been a little bit windy or rainy since everywhere we've gone so it feels so much more spacious but I don't actually mind with the roof down, it's quite cosy and if it doesn't warm up as much as I think it's going to warm up the roof will be coming back down again so I'll just wait for the, uh, well, we'll just wait for the uh, Heat to kick in, shall we? Because it just the washing up, it's ready to go. That's my job in a minute. Um, cool. I think I showed this in the last, I did show this in the last uh, video of um, showing what was in our van. And that is where we put our carbon monoxide detector um, for the night. <laughs> uh, again, we've got no 
where to put it, it was a little bit big this one. But um be flashing away telling us we're all okay. Morning everyone, um, so what a good night's sleep that was, because we didn't set our alarm clocks, we woke up at 10, because uh, it's dark, and it's warm, and it's raining, um, yeah, what a good sleep, so we sat downstairs, and um, had the roof up, for the first time, and had the heater on, so... Just a lazy day for us, we're not planning on doing too much, go for a walk, local, um, and then that's about it, we're going to have some breakfast now, can't wait, I'm starving, um, and, and then walk, and then eat, and then chill out, leaving tomorrow, so yeah, we're really rocking it this, this trip, but uh, well needed sleep. And look how cosy that is. You've got enough space on a, on a, on a, on a, in a, an ocean. So obviously a little bit less than the beach because you've got the cupboard. But uh, yeah, proper cosy. Well, oh, speak to you later. I've got all these pitches, all these empty pitches. So you can see um, quite a nice big pitch. We're just like the guides for summer, we're just showing you where to go when it's nice and warm and not raining. It's just stopped raining. It says it's going to rain till 12 and then there'll be no rain after that. But uh, look at that whopping, whopping big spaces here at uh, Donkey Farm Park in Preston, which is 20 minutes away from Blackpool. Obviously you've got Lynham. Lynham. Down south, you've got Lytham, uh, Lytham St Anne's, and Fleetwood, all that sort of area. General Waste, and you've got a really soppy dog walk here. And I tried to go in here last night, but uh, yeah, it's saturated and wearing trainers. Here we go. Look at that, Mo. Here we go. Must. Um, uh, <coughs> I'd say dog walking area, but I can see um, tent pegs and some electrics. So yeah, it's the tent area. But obviously, it's absolutely drenched. So I'm not going to walk through there. Just going to have to go the edges around here. Okay. Oh, you can see, that's the, that's the whole. I said not the whole site because I showed you the other bit. That's the bit where all the touring pitches are. Around the other, on the very the back of that um, reception stroke facilities is a lot of uh, carans. Cool. Just show you the caravan area. Play area for the kids. And then towards this way. So as I, um, and as you saw from last night, we went through the illuminations and um, it was good. We drove through it. Um, not quite like I remember as a kid, obviously, um, but the good memories that I had and uh, the time with my granddad, etc. Uh, is well worth a visit for us. It's a bit quiet, obviously, in December. It was raining, it was a bit foggy, but uh, we saw the lights and that was good enough for us and that's the main thing we came up here to just do um we're not gonna go back into blackpool today we're just gonna chill out as i mentioned earlier go for a walk stretch off a little bit um but yeah there's the van looking beautiful with the top up really nice to see um yeah she's looking lovely really nice sleep 
in the edges. There we go. Breakfast is being prepared. Uh, we're making French toast. And here we have French toast. Fighter planes take off from there as well. Practice landing. Cool. Malls. So malls spotted that we're near a pub. That's literally 10 minutes away. Oh, this is nice. Not even that really, just a nice little walk from the campsite. It's a nice old pub, isn't it? Open for coffee. Oh, interesting. Okay, we're going to have a pint in here. I think I've got this right this time. This is Donkey Creek Farm Caravan Park. And apologies because I've had a couple of pints of Guinness in a lovely pub, I must admit. It's literally like 10 minutes down the road called the Ship Inn. I recommend that for a few good beers. Best Guinness I've had for a while. £5.25 a pint and um, a good fish and chips. On a Tuesday, it's third off, so I'm not bigging them up with a ad here, but uh, we've just had a really good meal. And now we're going to bed in, settle in for the night, watch the football tonight. And uh, van's looking nice again. Come on, Mo, what's your sleeping partner? Ah, uh, second day and we're having omelettes today. So, a panda can do everything. Hey, Mo. this look at this look at this look the sun's out it's a beautiful day um nice day of traveling back and uh yeah i'm gonna unplug our lead and i just want to mention this is um you know it was mentioned to me before and it's good in information and good input and after me not to think so but always unplug from the mains before unplugging from the van for the obvious reasons and also try not to have your lead um, coiled which uh, I've had a good attempt at this time um, and then uh, so yeah so this is quite a long lead and it's not we really, didn't really need that much lead so um oh yeah so the other thing here look watch watch look look yeah you're on fighter display look at that Cool is that? That is so cool, Mo, isn't it? 
Hey, I came, came through yesterday. So just like just practicing around Blackpool, but that's pretty amazing. It's the second time it's been over now, so I'll, uh, I'll obviously be watching it a few more times as it comes past. But uh, yeah, so that gets me excited. Airplanes. Um, yeah, so back to that. I'm going to get a smaller lead for um, campsites like this, and then uh, we're going to pack up and go out in all. Hey, we're going to pack up and go. So like you can see, we're almost, you know, so that we've got the bin there, I've got to the bin over to the bin collection just over here. And then uh, turn the seats round, pop the roof down, and away we go. So, well you stay there, while I do this. It's nice when you get the, uh, the site to yourself, literally. Yourself. Two vans and a ca caravan that's nobody's in. So yeah, enough showers and toilets for me. It's also quite nice when you're just the only person in there. Apart from when you go to the shower at night when you just watch a scary film. That's uh, one thing else I have to stop doing. So, just going to put the roof down now and. Uh, Make our way back.